Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a review for the Letter to Santa Washi. It's a brand new product to the Lush Winter Collection 2015. Also, it's an extremely new product. It's only been around for a couple of weeks in Oxford Street and it's only just been released this week or last week online. So, let's get into it. If you've ever had a wash sheet, they give you it in this cardboard envelope. This one isn't the right one. This is for the Wash That Man shower sheet however when I bought this they didn't have the right cases for this because it was brand new like literally it came out that day when I got it Lush say now here's a treat to leave for Santa fair trade Ugandan vanilla and cinnamon leaf oil perfume the skin while the fresh apple pulp base melts onto your body turning into a rich creamy lather take a little piece into the shower to coat your body in sweet cake like fragrance and if you need to up your good deeds quota in time for the 24th there's plenty to share around and that is definitely true because these wash sheets aren't small they are pretty gigantic mine has split and plus I've used it so forgive this but normally it would come like that if you saw my lush winter haul then you would have seen this before it broke um, and you've probably heard me talk a little bit about this but this is the full review for anyone who hasn't tried it yet or wants to know a little bit more. The ingredients are fresh apple pulp, fair trade vanilla, absolute pine oil, cinnamon leaf oil and gardenia extract. Apples are full of antioxidants and vitamins and that really helps to nourish and uh, refresh the skin which you know during winter when your skin's like really dull and kind of not looking its best that's what you want something to come along and just revive your skin and revive you make you feel better make you feel brand new the cinnamon leaf oil is very warming stimulating has a spicy sweet scent and it is uplifting and helps to fight fatigue and low mood again christmas winter it's quite a tiring time i know my energy always feels quite drained so that's a really nice ingredient in there to really you know pep you up and make you feel less tired and less of those winter blues. The pine oil is fresh and cleansing. The fair trade vanilla absolute gives it the vanilla scent. Also it's uh, great for nourishing, protecting and adding moisture to the skin. And of course um, vanilla is that very comforting sweet smell, uh, quite a nostalgic scent to most people so that's going to just really make you feel you know good and quite happy generally speaking if you like vanilla of course and finally gardenia extract adds a soft touch to the fragrance it just helps to balance all the other scents out and um, make it a little bit softer otherwise this could be quite a strong product and also the gardenia extract is great for helping to relieve tension and headaches so the one thing that i want to mention about this product in particular is the fact that it shares the same smell as the vanilla delight body lotion which is a discontinued product unfortunately now and the vanilla delight shares the same smell as the vanillary perfume so good news if you are fans of the vanilla delight then you can still get the perfume and ultimately if you're fans of the vanillary range then you can get your hands on this and you can wash yourself with vanillary goodness i know whenever i find a fragrance that i love i just want to wash myself in it smell it spray it on me so if you're a fan of vanillary then i definitely recommend you get this because you can just have vanillary everything basically i'm pretty sure you, this would be really good to tear off and use in the bath um just put it you know crumble it under the water hold it under the water let it the water run over it create nice bubbles or put it in a sieve and the water runs over it and you get like nice foamy bubbles this is a great product if you are obsessed with that smell those two to me just smell the same um, I don't own the vanillary perfume, however I've smelled it enough times to remember and know what it smells like and I definitely think that is very similar. So definitely get a sample if you can. If you can get down to Oxford Street then try it in the store and if not maybe get, grab a sample of it if you order anything online. But yeah it's just it's nice and it's really decent size, really big actually. The great thing about this is that you can send it to people because it's flat so you know think about that going in your suitcase or going in a letter it's like a really nice way to cheat the system and send people a really nice present <laughs> um that's how i like to think about it anyway i mean how nice is it to like receive soap in the mail that's just crazy i do believe that's what they were trying to achieve when they made this so following on from the size matter you just have to tear a little piece off and then use it to wash yourself all over as mentioned before 
if I'm being generous I will use that piece which is not big at all in comparison to you know this is half a sheet and that's the size that I would use if I wanted to be generous if I wanted to be um like stin not stingy but I just I think this is the amount all the amount you need for a really nice wash and I think I used like that or less um this morning when I washed myself and the smell lingers by the way, that's a really good thing about this product. If you like lingering vanilla smells, then this is going to be right up your alley because I can smell it constantly and other people can smell it too, which is kind of what you want. You want to smell delicious. So yeah, you really don't need a lot and it does create a really nice lather. You can use it just straight onto your body, get your body wet and then work this on. It really kind of melts and um, goes very creamy and lathery very quickly. Or if you want to get away with using less, you can smush it into a loofah and then that will really help to not only buff away any dead skin and make your skin a lot brighter but it also helps to um, lather up the product a lot more. I just think if you want to get the most out of any product use a loofah. I call them shower floofs because you know like they're like all floofy. You can get them from anywhere though and they really just you know like I can get away with using a product that is like that big which is not even as big as my nail so if you know in comparison to the whole of this product that's a tiny amount you can get thousands of washes out of it okay maybe not thousands but you know like I can't even compre comprehend how many washes I would get out of it so really good value for money I found that it makes my skin really really soft the smell lingers my skin is very moisturized as, as well the smell is exactly like Vanilla Delight, as I've said. It's not as strong as when you sniff it directly from the product. It does become more of a softer scent, so if you find this a little bit too strong in person, then don't worry when you put it, when you wash yourself with it in the shower. It's a lot more soft and um, like toned down. It's not too strong and it's not too weak, it's just right. It's a Goldilocks of scents, it's just right. I think the product looks really, really cute. I like the wash sheets, I love the idea of them. They work really, really well. This is definitely my favourite wash sheet. And one of my favourite shower items, it's just, it's so quirky and unique and I would have to give it a 5 out of 5, I just, I just love it. These are definitely great for using in your hair, they're not as great as using a uh, shower jelly, um, however they still will really help to clean and soften your hair. Apples are really really good for helping to um, add shine and moisturise your hair and just like really condition your hair. So. This one would definitely be really good for your hair as well. So the products that I can kind of relate this to is Five Gold Rings, definitely. It's got that very vanilla-y smell to it, and it's a definitely a very warm vanilla -y smell. Stardust, I definitely feel like Stardust is a very vanilla -y kind of smell. It's, I feel like Stardust is quite similar to Butter Bear, but is a little bit more woody because of the rosewood, and is a little bit stronger. And just anything vanilla -y, scented anything kind of that warm vanilla scent I think if you like anything like Twilight and Shoot for the Stars those kind of warm honey Tom Crab Salute smells then you'll like this too so when I bought this product it was exclusive to Oxford Street and now I believe it's exclusive to Oxford Street in store but you can get it online so that's great if you can get yourself down to Oxford Street try it maybe even pick up a sample of it if you can it's it's lovely the other thing I just want to quickly cover is I am not going to keep it like this. I would tear some pieces off of this and I would chop it up, put it into a container of some sorts and then whenever you want to use it just take a piece out. With lots of reusable products you can let them like dry on the side of the bath and then pick them up later when they're dry and use them again. However because of the nature of these they go very melty and they kind of just turn to mulch so they're not really reusable so if you use a big chunk like this you'll be quite disappointed because it's not going to be really able to be reused so that's why I definitely recommend going for a really small piece because you'll use all of it and there won't be anything left over and you won't have wasted any product basically I'm going to tear both of these up into really small pieces just going to shred it with my hands or uh, cut it with some scissors and then I'm going to have loads of little strips that are ready to go whenever I need to use them. This is so so nice for travelling. You could tear like a corner piece off and that is all you need to take with you and that would last me for about a week. So yeah, definitely 
great for your money. This product is $12.95, which I know is quite steep for a lot of people, but considering how many uses you get out of this product, it's definitely worth every single penny, I believe. I paid $12.95 for this, and it was completely worth every single penny because I'm going to get so much use out of this. I hope this review has been really useful. Um, if there's any questions or anything, please, as always, let me know down below. I will get back to you as soon as possible. And again, also, if you want to contact me on any social media, I would love that. I love chatting to people, um, connecting. Ah, that sounded really creepy. But yeah, other than that, thank you so much for watching. Take care and have a fabulous evening, day, whatever you're doing. And I'll see you soon. Oh, one more thing. If anyone has tried the wash sheets or have tried has tried this one in particular, please let me know. I would love to hear your thoughts. Um, yeah, thank you so much. Bye, guys.